can't think of too many jobs that are much more complex than uh, the chief engineer on a major cruise ship. It's an awesome responsibility. The chief engineers are, are magicians in some ways that, the, that they can make all this happen. They, they have a, a staff of a, a hundred people that have various disciplines from electricians to plumbers to fitters to mechanics. The engine control room is the, the, the heart of the vessel. By using the computers and the operative system, we are be able to uh, start the vessel, to start the power plant, to start uh, giving lighting, and ultimate as a propulsion ready to go. You're looking at a really a small city that's moving. You provide your own power, all your own electricity generation, all of the services that a city for maybe as many as 8,000 people need. Either way, in engine room, we go daily to look at the equipment, and then uh, we have our comments shared with the first engineer, with the staff chief, uh, in what actually could be improved. He's also responsible for training of the, of the engineers that maintain and operate those systems. First priority for, uh, for us is uh, the safe life at sea. The evolution of the job goes parallel with the evolution of the equipment. We manage with the same confidence, and this I have to say thank you to Royal Caribbean and to the system that can make people like me feel confident to run this vessel on the technical side. We're fortunate in, uh, at Royal Caribbean Cruises in all of our brands to have some of the best chief engineers in the world.